Understanding Reprisal Attacks in English. Hello everyone, today, we're going to explore a complex and significant phrase in English, reprisal attacks. This phrase is often used in news reports and discussions about conflict situations. Understanding its meaning and usage is crucial for grasping the nuances of English language, especially in the context of global events. So, let's dive in. Reprisal attacks refer to violent actions taken in retaliation for a harm or injustice perceived to have been inflicted by another party. These attacks are usually a response to an initial act of aggression or offense. It's important to note that the term carries a negative connotation, often implying that these actions may not be justified or legal. In this section, we will look at examples of how reprisal attacks are used in sentences. For instance, the bombing was seen as a reprisal attack for the earlier military strike. Communities fear reprisal attacks after the controversial court verdict. These examples help to illustrate how the phrase is commonly used in news reports and discussions about conflicts or retaliation. Reprisal attacks are not just about the physical act of retaliation. They often have broader implications. They can escalate conflicts, affect diplomatic relations, and impact innocent civilians. Understanding this term also involves recognizing the moral and ethical questions it raises about justice and retaliation. To enrich your vocabulary, let's explore some synonyms and related terms. Retaliation, vengeance, counterattack, payback. Knowing these words can help you understand various contexts where similar ideas are expressed. I hope this video has been informative and has enhanced your understanding of the phrase, reprisal attacks. Remember, language is not just about words but also about the ideas and histories they carry. Keep exploring, and see you in the next video.